Yo, what's going on guys? JV here and today I have some more MLB The Show 20 content for you. In today's video, we're going to go over the new content drop today. A bunch of new fire cars. We got the new 10th inning program. We have the new World Series program cards. We're going to go over all of them in this video. But before we get to it, if you guys wouldn't mind hitting that thumbs up button, liking the video, subscribing, turning your notification bells on, it would be greatly appreciated. But yes, Let's get to the video. All right, guys, first, let's check out the new content in the World Series program. This is going to be part two of the World Series program, and it starts out with the Peter Fairbanks card, fireballer, right-handed pitcher, 6'6", six, six standing on the mound as well from the Tampa Bay Rays. He tallied three strikeouts to close out the ALCS. Game seven and clinch series absolutely fire piece of content here just because that sinker and fastball combo that he has is going to be wicked with that slider he's got the 116 k through nines i know you can't see it because my my uh my mug is on the screen but yes he will have no issues throwing 101 102 miles an hour with with the quirks again 66 on the mound cannot wait to use Peter Fairbanks. That's the first card. Let's check out the next one. All right, guys, next up we have Diego Castillo. We have a three pitch array from him, the slider, sinker, fastball. This again could be a, a nicely used card, especially in BR, but we're gonna try him out. We'll have a debut to you, uh, debut video out for that, so pay attention. But yes, Diego Castillo, he's got the 117 K through nines, 114 hit through nines again. I know my face is in the way. Again, I said the three pitch combo, the slider sinker combo, which is always great, plus the four seam fastball, which should pump in at about 99 to 100 miles an hour. Again, another good piece of content. Next up, we have the Kevin Kiermeyer, 97 overall. And for the hitting cards here, I'm going to take my mug off the screen. As you can see, a nice card, bomb on defense, an absolute beast defensively. So if you're looking for somebody to have defensively coming off your bench to maybe take over for a guy like Yelich or somebody you might have in your outfield. This Kevin Kiermeyer card is a good one to have. Like I said, one of the more beautiful swings in MLB The Show from that left side of the plate. It's just so smooth. He reminds me a little bit of Brantley and then obviously the 99 fielding, 99 ar uh, arm, 94 acceleration and 99 reaction time helps as well. Next up, we have 98 Justin Turner. He plays first, second, short and third absolutely smokes the ball he's uh you know he's good enough defensively to where he's not going to kill you again another good card cannot wait to try out all these new pieces of content next up on the list we have steve pierce making a return and if you're in the moe the show community you know what this guy's all about absolutely mashes the baseball from the right side he plays first second left and right so you could put him in at second base which is where i think we'll see a lot of them early on but yes this card rakes. Trust me when I tell you, look at those power numbers and just think 125 in the back of your head because this card swings it like he has 125 power. Let's check out the next one. 99 overall Walker Bueller. Let's go. This right here is a fire, fire piece of content. Walker Bueller, and I hope his, his pants are skin tight because he's one of those guys who, who gets on the mound and he, he's trying to show off those legs. So hopefully it's realistic. He's got the the way too tight pants, you know, pause, I guess we can say, but so he throws that four seam slider cutter, knuckle curve and two seamer five pitch array, 118 K through nine, 110 hits through nine. This is a guy that's going to go into my starting rotation immediately. Cannot wait to use him. Walker Bueller, 99 overall. Let's check out the next one. We got Randy. We knew we were getting a 99 overall Randy card, right? So he plays left center in right field. He's got 125 for contact versus righties and lefties. He's got 125 power versus righty, as well as 112 power versus lefty. Diamond defense. I wish his speed was a little higher, but this card absolutely looks like he smokes the ball. I've never used him. I couldn't tell you how his swing is, but we're going to find out. I'll pop him in the debut video. And then last but not least in the World Series program, guys, we have 99 overall Corey Seager, MVP of the World Series. He had eight homers and 20 ribbies in the postseason, which is bomb bombarctuous, if that's even a word. Um, so, yeah absolutely beast at the plate he's got diamond defense he's going to be good enough defensively he can also play second and third he might be playing some second base for me while i have tatis at short but yes awesome 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 second half of the world series program all right guys next up we have the joe morgan 99 overall new program that just came out today with 
everything else, obviously. Obviously, we just had the passing of Joe Morgan, so rest in peace to him. But here's a look at his second base card. I was actually hoping for a little bit more, especially offensively from this card. But at the end of the day, I'm not going to complain. Look at the speed. He's lights out as far as defense and base running goes. And then obviously he kills right-handed pitching and he's he's so-so versus the lefties. He's a guy I'm going to use. I don't think he's a guy I can use over Seager at second base, but he's a guy who's going to find my lineup, pinch run, and who knows, maybe he's just OP and maybe he'll be, he'll be end game. But looking at him, he's not good enough against lefties to be my everyday starter, but you bet your, uh, you bet your bottom dollar I'm going to try him out. So yeah, 99 overall, Joe Morgan. All right, guys. So last but not least, we have the 10th inning program with the end game reward at the end. And that is the MVP Ken Griffey Jr. As you can see, he's got 124 and 125 contact and power versus righties. He's definitely good enough against lefties, guys. He's got the 99 contact and 109 power against left handers. 91 vision, which is rare, kind of where I was hoping he'd be. I was really hoping he was going to be above that 90 mark in, as far as vision goes. So that's awesome. Great defensively. Good enough speed to play center. I, I just can't play Griffey anywhere but center. So I'm glad he's able to play center field. Let's take a look at some of the rewards they're offering us too in this 10th inning program. I'm um, not going to lie. I like these two calling cards. So shout out to SDS for those. I've been asking for more calling cards and emblems for a while now. But as you can see, we'll take a look here. You also have the 10th inning choice pack here at 150. Um, it's not. There we go. So you got 99 Ralph Kiner, 99 Andrew Miller, and 99 Mackenzie Gore. I cannot wait to get my hands on this Andrew Miller card for my All Indians team. He's a team. He's also a card that needs to go right into your bullpen. This card is going to be amazing. He's got the slider, four seam, sinker mix. Um, just a card that I cannot wait to use. He's going to be pumping, you know, mid 90s, high end 90s with an insane slider with a quirky delivery. He's who I'm taking in this 150 stars. I would hear a lot of people talk about Mackenzie Gore. I'll probably try out Mackenzie Gore, but yes, awesome, awesome content for the 150 stars. And like I said, guys, 300 stars, you're getting Ken Griffey Jr. So you got the 10th inning conquest map, obviously. You have the collections. The Joe Morgan's going to give you 20 points. You have your missions. Everything the same as usual. Your 10th inning showdown. But yeah, that's pretty much going to do it, guys. Like I said, pop in there. Check out all the new content. I hope this video helped you out. I hope this video was what you were kind of looking for. Just a deep dive in today's content drop. We got 99 Griffey. We got 99 Seeger. We got 99 Andrew Miller. We got Andy not, uh, 99 Andy. So much fire content. I feel like the video is not going to do it justice, but I did want to get this video out to you guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the content. If you did, don't be afraid to show some support. But until next time, guys. Keep on the lookout for some more videos, some debut videos, the Griffey debut, all that good stuff. I appreciate you guys for watching, and uh, yeah, go get after it. Go grind. Get that 10th inning program out of the way. Peace, guys.